Hi friends, how are you? Welcome to Guruvira Textile and Fashion Technology Tutorials. This video clip is continuation of the jacquard. In my first part, I gave introduction why jacquard machine is required, why, why jacquard, what is the importance of uh, jacquard machines and its mechanisms how it is helpful, how it is benefit, how it is helping in producing the complicated pictures. See, now complicated pictures means complicated designs on the fabric by means of interlacing the warp and craft. Usually the industries are going for repeats. For 63 inch width fabric, okay, how for 60 inch width fabric, repeats are done. For say example, one repeat I am telling you, this is one repeat, this is one repeat is there. This repeat, what is the repeat is there? Suppose this is the design is there. I am missing, okay. This is the one design is there, okay. This is one design, okay. Hope, hope uh, light shade will be there. Shading, I think shade is appearing on this, okay. Say this design is there. This is one design is there. This is one repeat. Okay. Okay now. This is one repeat. Okay. This is one repeat is there. In this, this is one repeat. This repeat is adjusted to the width of the fabric so that the design can be achieved. This repeat, this one or reverse side or that depends upon whatever modification is there. So, to a, for one repeat, how many warp threads are need to be left? Say out of 5000 width wise warping threads, okay, say, um, say 100 threads, 100 warp threads are required, 100 warp threads are required, and here. 150 picks are required for one repeat of this design for one repeat of this design 100 warp threads are required 150 picks are required okay so for this only for this to achieve this how many hooks are required 100 hooks only required not 5000 hooks Okay, only 150 for one to complete one repeat 100 warp threads. Say 100 warp threads, suppose 100 is there in out of 5000 threads for each, each and every 100, 100, 100 designs will be accommodated. This is simple design, but complicated will be there. 100 or 200 threads are required, hooks are required, sometimes oh, 1000 hooks are required to lift. Okay, whatever it may be, assume that. This is one case. This is about the designs. Then, how many hooks? Now say 100 warp threads to be left means 100 hooks are need to be left, operate. 100 hooks are need to be operate. Okay, now 100 hooks are need to be operate means here 100 needles are to be operate. 100 needles are to be operate. See, I am writing here, first, hundred, first step is 100 warp threads, warps to be lift, okay. Then, how many hundred hooks to be lift, third one is 100 needles, right, correct. 100 needles to be operated. Then how needles are operated? How, on what base, who is lifting? Which mechanism is lifting? Who, who will decide? Which mechanism will decide? Okay, we understood 100 threads are to be lifted. That 100 hooks that are to be lifted. So that hooks are operated by the needles. Needles are taking decisions. Which to make one design in out of 100, which thread has to come first, 
then which the thread has to come second third one will operate will connected to the will connected directly or indirectly to the hooks okay that hooks are connected to the strings that is lifting threads that lifting threads are connected to the sheds okay these needles okay operated by the needles see before coming to the needles operation these needles are operated how this operated based on the cards punching cards please subscribe to my channel gurubira textile and fashion technology tutorials please share to your friends okay and like it thank you very much